be hung from the highest rafter. He tells her, look, you don't have to bring me there. Literally what we were just joking about. We can just go. If they're mean, like, let's, we have horses and food. We can go anywhere. You want to go grab beer? Yeah, fuck yeah. <laughs> um, and she's like, but I do, though. You know, I, I made this oath, so I have to. But, you know, Richard, I noticed that you're a little down. Your arms are all cut up. And I don't think what you need is a teacher or a, a prison guard right now. I think you need a friend. And and that's all I want to be. I just want to be your friend and all of this is silliness, which is obviously a tactic that you could use on a six-year-old. <laughs> I mean, I did all of this just so we could be besties. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like cable guy besties. I just want to hang out. No big deal. <laughs> but it is kind of a big deal. You're way overkill. Oh, and I literally just saw you stab your friend in the back. So... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, uh uh-uh. uh. <laughs> Fuck no. I love the way he says it. No, I decline to offer you my friendship <laughs> or my back. Boom. Fucking boom. It's also funny that she's offering her friendship, but he doesn't like he doesn't turn down her friendship. He's like, You can't have mine. My friendship. <laughs> Sure, I have yours, but fuck you. You don't get <laughs> shit from me. Well, her friendship is literally her stabbing her friend in the back. Right. So her friendship's value is way down. <laughs> Rich is like, yeah, so I haven't killed any of my friends. My friendship is the shit, and you can't have it. <laughs> None. So, also, friends don't keep friends in collars. So, when I ask for help... To get out of the collar, you're either going to help me or you're going to be, like, a dead enemy. So. That is a solid second reason for a friend to say, here, give me the keys. <laughs> you know, because the collar, I mean, there's, yeah, never mind. It's not locked with with a lock. That joke didn't make a whole lot of sense, but uh, thank you guys for following me yeah, through that. Yeah, well. Uh, hey, look, beer. Hey, look. <laughs> <laughs> hey, shooting star. Uh <laughs> And Verna, again, is like the the fucking beam in the central hall, the highest one. That's going to be the one. That's that's going to be my, my resting place. <laughs> I mean, this, this was put in there to be funny, right? Yeah. Her kind of making this crack that, oh, they're going to kill me when they see you. And I mean, it is. It is funny. Verna is a very stern woman think that's fair to say yeah um so it's good to see her have a little sense of humor even if it is a kind of dark sense of humor yeah i mean i can appreciate a good dark sense of humor but at least she has one is my point and and it makes you wonder because we still don't know whether or not verna is a good guy or a bad guy oh true we don't know and so she has now officially cracked a joke i'm gonna say the first two were not, but this one for sure was a joke. Yeah. Yeah, it was a joke. <gasps> okay. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. I just read um, the comment from Al. I'm disinclined to acquiesce to your request. Means no. And Means that's from no. <laughs> <laughs> Pirates of the Caribbean. That was Captain Barbosa. Um, those are my favorite movies. Not like top five i'll say but like as far as a series goes pirates are number one with the bullet jade knows this the last time yes. we went to uh disneyland the last time the only time we went to disneyland <laughs> together there was nobody on the pirates rides so we rode that bitch like three times yeah it was fun and it was awesome <laughs> yeah nate's kind of obsessed with pirates in general but that's I, <laughs> I mean, it may be in my blood, for it, one. It might be. We know that. Um, but for two, swords. <laughs> <laughs> I, anybody who has listened to this podcast for any amount of time knows that swords I, and I drinking. like swords. Swords and drinking. Oh, my gosh. You know, I never even put those two things together. Oh, I have. <laughs> <laughs> we used to drink and, a lot of rum before we realized beer was where it was at. Yeah. That and really big hats. 
<laughs> really big hats. Well, I think that does it for this chapter. You guys, thank you so much for hanging out with us tonight. We always love going live and and talking with you guys. And I think you guys were funnier than we were today, so that's good. <laughs> And we appreciate you guys showing up, even though we didn't, like, tell you at all or warn you. Oh, yeah. I mean, <laughs> these are the the hardest core of the hardcore, I would say. <laughs> they were like, what? They're doing a thing? And then, then they showed up. But we love all of you, and if you couldn't join us tonight. <laughs> I mean, it was last second, so. <laughs> yeah. And we know that, uh, that everybody can't make it always on the weeknights either. That's so. Right. We just enjoy you guys listening and having our little little group of book friends. If you wanted to get a hold of us, <laughs> you could. You can find us at Patreon. Nope, I'm being all I I just flipped that all upside down. <laughs> <clears throat> I apologize. Get it, baby. <laughs> so, so, okay. So, if you wanted to get a hold of us, you can find us on our email, you can I I just all over. I'm sorry. You can email us at podcastatt at gmail dot com. You can find us on Facebook at podcast att. Nope, at all the things, right? <laughs> yeah, just search all the things. Search all the things, and you can find us on Instagram at podcast att. Nailed it. And you can give us a call or a text at our phone number six one six two five nine zero zero two five. Double nailed it. We would love to hear anything at all from you guys. If you wanted to tell us about something that's going to come up in a little while, we will definitely like save that, put that away somewhere, and whenever we get to that chapter, we will pull out your little information that you sent us or thoughts or whatever, and we will put it on the podcast, and it'll be awesome. <laughs> you you killed that. It was awesome. Good job. Also, Patreon is still a thing, and we like we'll see you there if you're there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we've got a lot of stuff on there that's awesome. A lot we're going to be adding soon. Thank you guys for listening, and we will see you soon. Bye. <laughs>